Olha. Come all you sons of liberty and listen to my tale. The story of those ranging days I will to you unveil. Tis of those valiant heroes, God bless them Sing, God save the King, Dan Gilbert and Ben Hall. Ben Hall, he was a squatter, and he owned six hundred head. A peaceful, quiet man was he until he met Sir Fred. The troopers burned his homestead down. His cattle perished all. I've all my sentence yet to earn was the word of brave Ben Hall. John Gilbert was a flag. Ben Hall was one of the most tragic of the bush rangers. Most people think he was wrongly done by the police. He seems to have been a harmless sort of fellow, merely trying to set himself up in life as a farmer. Well, he may have been a bit of a larrikin as well, but the police kept picking on him and they took him to jail for something he hadn't done and when he came home his wife had shot through with an ex-policeman and they'd burnt all his cattle in his house and so he became a bush ranger. From Bathurst down to Golden Town They made the coaches stand While far behind Sir Frederick's men when laboring through the land and then the Canawindra's best hotel they gave a public ball we don't hurt them that don't hurt us says Dun Gilbert and Ben Hall they held the gold commissioner to ransom on the spot but young John Vane surrendered after Mickey Burke was shot. And O'Malley at Cohen Blood did like a hero fall. But we'll take the country over yet, says Dun Gilbert and Ben Hall. They never robbed a needy man. The records go to show. But staunch and loyal to their mates, unflinching to their foes. So we'll drink a toast tonight, the boys, their memories to recall. Let's sit and sing, God save the King, Dun Gilbert and Ben Paul. Many of the songs are about rebelliousness and resistance to authority. Much of our music came out of the Irish tradition. Some early songs are copies of Irish rebel songs, for instance. And the Irish who were transported here as convicts kept the rebellious Republican spirit alive. I think Ned Kelly was, some say anyway, that Ned Kelly was attempting to set up a republic of northeastern Victoria. This rebellious spirit carried on to the days of the bush rangers when the Irish still tended to be a poor and oppressed group of people, often mistreated by the police. Even those who didn't actually become bush rangers themselves sympathised with the bush rangers, and so you had this romantic view of the Robin Hood ethos in the bush rangers of Australia. Men like Ben Hall and Ned Kelly are probably the greatest folk heroes we've got. One reason we can perform this music is that we can sympathise with people like the Bush Rangers and the Shearers and the Swaggies. Even though we're cut off from them by a hundred years or more, we can still imagine what it must have been like to be in their shoes because we've taken in so much by singing songs about them. One of the basic appeals of this music is as dance music.